President Biden is under enormous pressure, speaking of college kids, to come up with a plan now to relieve college debt. And I'm wondering especially what you think about this, because you are a strategist and have been one of the most successful ones for the Democratic Party. A lot of people are saying this is a loser issue. I'll give you some brief numbers here why that is. 13 percent of Americans have college debt, federal college debt. So that's not a lot of people you're working to. 65 percent don't go to college at all. Wow. 50 percent of the college debt it goes to people going to grad school, which, huh. come on, a lot of that is just bullshitting around. <laughs> you don't know what to do, and you can keep going to school for free. So it just looks like a loser issue for the party that is trying to win back the working class, that we're going to subsidize. We who didn't go to college and didn't benefit from that are going to subsidize you to get your degree in gender studies. <laughs> and sports marketing and all the other bullshit that they take in town. I, I, I think it's a loser issue for Biden. What do you think? I don't believe in student loan forgiveness. Let me know in the comment section if you do. Okay. Yeah, well, and this is revealing a big secret, so don't tell anybody. We Democrats have a, a lab, two labs actually, secret labs, one in Berkeley and one in Brooklyn, where we come up with ideas to completely piss off the working class, and it's working wonderfully. <laughs> Labs, you say, actual yes. Labs. Oh, yes. They yeah. have, they have, and they all have PhDs. Right. In, in pissing <laughs> off the working class. Somehow, in my lifetime, the Democrats have gone from being the party of the factory floor to being the party of faculty lounge. Right. Now, I, I went last week. I spent uh, Wednesday last week uh, in Chicago with the Machinist Union. Hung out with the machinists all day. Great guys. Not a one of them came up to me and said, "Gee, I really hope you take my tax dollars to pay off the debt of somebody who went to Stanford." Right. Okay. If, but nope. I have. I, so Biden's under enormous pressure. He's, he's not for it. He didn't campaign for it. He says he'll relieve maybe $10,000, which I suppose is good. But what I'd much rather see Democrats do is go back to their roots, which is earn it. We're the party that created the GI Bill. Nobody called that free college because it wasn't. The guys who got the GI Bill earned it. Yep. Why don't we have a system where yep. we say, you want to get out of your college debt? Serve your country. Yeah, yeah. Marine Corps, Peace Corps, AmeriCorps. Not everybody can carry a rifle, but you can, you can mentor a kid. And you give two years of service, then you will have earned that and expand it so we have community college, job training. We, we need more mechanics, yes. not MBAs. Yes. And that's where the Democrats focus ought to be. So I don't believe in student loan forgiveness. If you do, please let me know in the comment section why. I believe that the people who receive an education with a student loan or the people with student loan, bro, you agreed to the loan. You were okay with it. So you have to pay it back. That's just the way I see it. And Democrat knows this. If they allow student forgiveness, does that mean anybody going to college in the future would have to go for free? What about the people who already paid it back? Are they getting their money back? Don't get me wrong. I understand that the cost of higher education is super high. So that's something we need to look at, something we need to talk about. But still, bro. And I agree. I agree with what he said. How about if you want to go to school for free, you serve your country. I'm not an expert, but I believe after three to four years of being active, you receive close to 100% in free college from the military. What about that? That is something I am I am for. So let me know in the comment section what do you think about this and uh, this is a good topic. So let me know. God bless you.